Good morning, namaste, and welcome back to my channel. So now I am on day two in Hampi, and I'm going to take a conical boat on Sanapur Lake. Now this place was famous for going to Hippie Island, but Hippie Island no longer exists, my goodness me. So it's just going to be a really chill boat ride with gorgeous, gorgeous views. I can't wait to get on that conical. And here I am inside the conical, waiting to see these amazing views of gorgeous, gorgeous and pink. Oh my goodness me, amazing, beautiful, hampy. So once you see the valleys, rice fields, scenery, village life, you come to this beautiful, beautiful rock waterfall. It's so, so gorgeous. What it is, I think hampy really steals a piece of your heart for sure. and chill restaurant. I like the name so I think I will go in.
So in addition to the lovely floor seating, one thing that they all seem to have here in Hampi is something really convenient. Yay, somewhere to plug in your phone. So in Hampi, this is really handy for tourists. It's a good thing to know. It might sound a bit boring for a YouTube channel, but believe me, it's very, very practical. I love tourist cafes and in Hampi they are gorgeous because as I was showing you on the film that's where you're seated on the floor on those really gorgeous food stalls. Oh it's lovely. So with these cafes cost wise you will certainly spend under 500 rupees on a meal, definitely under that, um, the tourist cafes. I would say if you come out for a meal and get a couple of bottles of water, a couple of chai, a meal, you would still probably pay up to 500 rupees. But of course, if you're going to get a starter main course dessert, it will definitely be over that. Thank you. It's one of these where I love tourist cafes and I love chai. Cheers! Ah, lovely! Welcome to Ampi! Thank you! Kaveri, welcome to Ampi! Thank you! I am staying with my friend Vijay. He's got this lovely restaurant, the Woodstock restaurant that I showed you. And uh, just across the way, that's where my hut is that I showed you on a room tour on a previous vlog, which I will link above. So Vijay, how long have you had this cafe? Uh, this one year. One year. Are you missing all the international tourists yeah, during these COVID times? Of course, I miss the international tourists. Why do you miss them? Because of the lockdown, Corona. Oh, so, no, but why do you miss them? What's so nice about the international tourists? Because they're nice when they come and talk, you know, we meet different, different ah, people and yes. different culture. Ah, different I see. Soul, you know? Oh, I understand, yeah. Well, there you go, lovely. So when you can get your tourist visas, yeah. you can come to Hampi and stay with Vijay. He has hosted me for my whole time here. I know I'm a pain in the bum, but he has been amazing. So thumbs up to Vijay. If you like Vijay, then comment below. <laughs> Thank you, Vijay, and I'm sure the international tourists will come back at some point. You're welcome, Kaveda. Lovely. Bye. Today and I will link that vlog above because it was just amazing because I saw the chariot and that was my dream to come to Hampi and see the chariot and it doesn't stop there. There were so many of this new delight and then there was Hanuman and all the temples and all the ruins tours that I did and then today with the boat ride, the conical ride, oh, and Sanapur Lake and then Sanapur Village, it was just beautiful. So thank you all very much indeed for watching my episodes of Hampi. I hope you enjoyed them as much as I did. And if you like what you see and you see what you, you like, you are welcome to subscribe to my channel. Much gratitude to all those that do subscribe. And if you like the video, you know the drill, you press the like button. So shanti shanti shanti, om namah shivaya. Thank you for watching. Kisses, mwah, and see you on the next vlog.